I know everybody I go like we I go like Still we iron Come in all of lies mm. Smile my child We are the brother Let you be them Hi, I'm Jamie coming to you from Zone Plus Media and we are on Port Zante again and we are here with the guys from Unstoppable Sounds. So guys, introduce yourselves for our audience. Yeah, they call me Status. I'm the selector. Okay. My name is Busky. Everybody know that. <laughs> Respect. Okay. So Unstoppable Sounds. Tell us how long you guys have been in business. Maybe about six years now. And since Jamie passed away, that, that's when we create Unstoppable because before you also play for Evolution. Oh, okay. And then me and Jamie went and we created Unstoppable. But he, you know, he passed away. So then, we was struggling with different selectors, then find the virgin status, so then now. And everything just set there now, because you know what I mean? You know, up and down and trying to hire a selector to go near this or go this way. You got to want somebody around all the time, you know what I mean? Dedicated, and this man dedicated, just as well Jamie was. Okay. Respect. So, let's go to you. Tell us what made you want to be a part of Unstoppable Song. Well, um, growing up all the time, you know, I always liked music, and my father was actually a DJ, but never reached on the mainstream like that. So, um, he was always in the blood, you know what I mean? And, I remember as a little boy, I can't sleep without music. That's me. Everything is me is music. So, seeing those guys performing um, back in the days, you know, I said, boy, I'm going to be a soul man. I mean, I meet Busky one day and I tell him, but hey, I'm going to be the next Jamie. You know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but he tell me, no, you can't be the next Jamie, but you could be. You know what I mean? And I said, yeah, well, you know what I mean? You know, and then from there we connect, and ever since that we've just been doing good. Tell us about the name Unstoppable Songs. How did you come up with that name? Well, first of all, when you finish with evolution, when you, you break apart, mm -hmm. I just sit down and say, tell Jamie, I think we should name Unstoppable because I is a guy, I always make up name. Mm -hmm. I make up name for club. We have a club named Golden Amon. I used to give the name. So I always a give name to party, to session, wherever dance, you know what I mean, I just walk out. He's unstoppable. True we done, they can't stop us. So he's unstoppable. Fantastic. Now, every sound system has its own unique flair, its own style. Tell us what makes unstoppable sounds, unstoppable sounds. Well, we just, um, we just any one job. We can play anything, anytime, anywhere. And we, uh, we go according to how the sessions if I understand what I mean. Different people, different settings, yeah, we can do anything. So can adapt. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I've seen you guys perform one or two times, a few times actually. Tell me what gives you the energy to jump off of the stage, to talk to the people, to say the things that you say. Well, that come naturally, yeah. Mm -hmm. So you grow up in the ghetto still and you don't know. We see enough suffocation and we see energy. I also play sport. We also play for sports. I play for chatters. I could play tennis. I could play baseball. Anything I feel like I could play. Around. All around us. So the energy comes from within man. Mm -hmm. Because we believe in a God and once you believe in a God, God going to put you, put the energy in you to deliver to the people. It's like you're selling a plate of food and you got to come out and make sure the food proper and everything designed good for people to want it. Mm -hmm. So you have to bring your energy to make people love you. Okay. So how do you prepare for gigs? I know, let's say we book you for a party and we tell you, well, this party is going to have X amount of people, it's going to be here, it's going to be... How do you prepare for, for something like that? Well, um, why? <laughs> it just come naturally. Mm -hmm. We got the session. So you have practice session? Prepare, no. Honestly, uh -huh. we practice once from since we met and from that we never practice again. Mm -hmm. We just connect. So the chemistry. So you guys are just in sync? Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. And sure in the business long time, same way still. Mm -hmm. I know how the whole energy of the sound business goes. So anybody come with me, they could connect. But it's how they could connect. I got some people don't like listen. Mm 
And this man is a man status, he listen. Jamie also he also listen. If you could sit down with a person like for five hours and you're trying to show him well, this is how these kind of conscious selection go. Cause most guys they're more like into dance hall. Mm -hmm. And the pattern a uh, 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 playing sound, you gotta play everything. And you gotta learn how to play from reggae come real up. Even if you have bust a tree soaker or ten soaker, you know, you gotta know how to play everything. He could have played everything, but he never the hottest, they never the hottest in conscious. Oh. I love as well. Mm -hmm. And that's why I come in. Mm -hmm. Because true, you know the sound thing. I know that is the energy we want to push. We just don't want to push dance all, dance all, dance all. And feel like dance all is the only thing supposed to play in dance. Mm -hmm. That's how most of the session them going now. But we got different style where we play everything. Mm -hmm. And people now we say, but I like to come to them and party because they're going to play something for me. And you're supposed to give everybody something in the party. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We cater to everybody. Everybody. Even the R&B girls got them screaming. Mm -hmm. Celine Dion. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Mary J. Blight. That's my artist. You know what I mean? You got to give the girls them what they want. Coming into a sound that already existed status, was it difficult for you to find your feet? Um, honestly, at first, I was um, skeptical and I said bye. It's gonna be a lot of pressure, but after I went in, I went to gigs and by idea like from I feel like idea from ever since. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no pressure at all. Pressure. So the chemistry was that good from from the start. Beginning. I guess too. Um, I guess because I always wanted it. That's me. I always eager, willing to learn. Um, you know what I mean? So you just come natural. Okay, well, in every field, there are some issues, especially the entertainment field in St. Kitts and Nevis right now. You hear issues about DJs having issues with promoters, promoters having issues with DJs, persons liking this particular style to persons not liking that style so much, and that kind of thing. What are some of the issues that you would say you are faced with as a sound system? Um, issues, I would say that... Um, we get judged a lot sometimes in terms like somebody say, oh, that's unstoppable, but they never actually really come to a dance and hear us play. Mm -hmm. They will tell the promoter sometimes, why not the sound yet, the sound ain't ready yet, and never, but they actually never hear us play. Because once you hear us play, definitely you're going to hear us. So that's basically one of the main issues. How I feel with the issue part? It ain't no issue. It's just that the man come out and be focused mm -hmm. with whatever we're doing. And you got some people might not like it, you know what I mean? Ain't everybody gonna like it. Eh? Mm -hmm. It's like, but you just got to try to please the majority. Mm -hmm. A majority rule. Mm -hmm. So you would say some of the issues are persons within the business backbiting each other? <laughs> yes, you have a Simply lot. put. Yeah, you have a lot of backbiting within the business, mm -hmm. to be real. Uh, if some people know you're good, they know you're good now. But what they try to do is hide you try to tell certain people, oh, don't hire him, he's this, he's that. You know what I mean? And I don't think that nobody should be back talking, no sound. Even if you got a young sound coming up, I feel everybody deserves a chance to bust. And most of the time, certain sound, they ain't want no young sound bust. And I believe in every sound bust, because I will be playing with evolution. We, we help us Charlie sound. Mm -hmm. We help us other sound will come around evolution view so one and give them young sound a chance. Mm -hmm. And that's what I will do anytime, give anybody a chance. But certain people, they don't want nobody else make it they feel like it's them one supposed to eat. But in Jamaica, how sound business go? If you got a special club, every song got a chance to play in the club. Mm -hmm. You call it wrong robin, you go wrong, but certain people you also just back talk. Tell the promoter them oh he can't plan the set, he this, he that, you know what I mean? But I don't carry no feelings with none of them up to today. Mm -hmm. I still love them and show them the best of me because I believe in God. I mean believe in back talking and undermining the body. Mm -hmm. That positive vibe is important. Where do you guys see the future of entertainment going in St. Catherine's Nevis? What do you think the future is? Well, I think the future could be real bright for us, eh? Mm -hmm. If we come together and start to do things as like entertainers, singers, everybody come together and create a shop. Mm -hmm. 
you know in, in Jamaica they create sunsplash politician because society people business never want to help out the small man and they don't so what they do in Jamaica they come together the singers the band everybody come together and create sunsplash I think we could do that in St. Kitts the band the sounds the singers them keep a show keep a big local show and whatever we get, we put it into the next show and continue and continue and continue till it get great. And then everybody start to eat. You can't eat the first time or the second time or the third time. Keep on going. Mm -hmm. But but that will take unity. That will take persons working together. Well, we need to work together. Can nobody helping us? Is we trying to help ourselves? So we what we gotta do? Come together. And the issues that we used to got, drag it aside and work out people in helping us. The mm -hmm. are to create a show, cause everybody doing a show, but what about we on a local show? With our local artists, local bands. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Local sound and create something and call it local event. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you see that happening in the near future? It's possible. Mm -hmm. It's possible. Um kinda hard to predict but maybe if everybody could have spread the differences aside, then it should happen. What's next for Unstoppable Sounds? We've talked about entertainment-wise, the future of entertainment in St. Kitts, but where, do, where would you guys like to be in the not-too-distant future? Well, maybe do it, doing a little tour. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Um, so you'll be Unstoppable International? Definitely, definitely. Yeah, we just don't market ourselves here. We want to like um, see ourselves further in the future. You know what I mean? Achieve bigger things, to do bigger, to do bigger things, um, to sink kids on the map again. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Good. Yeah, well, mm -hmm. I believe in the sound, not just playing in sink it. That is of Antigua, Jamaica thing. I think in far, I always tell you so. Japan, England, we in China tonight, Amsterdam. Yeah, big up my Holland people, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Them is the place I want to go, Africa, and play sound. Let me see how my African people then respond, you know what I mean? And not only that, we take our local music up to, 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 to these places. But that's what I'm saying. Most of these sounds, then we got a little chance to go foreign. I'm being honest, they don't promote the local enough. They go out, they play the same Jamaican, Jamaican, Trinidad. You know what I mean? Barbados, back to America. But want to be local, we local talent right now to a high, high level. Now. And this sound don't care where we go. We always promote local. Because that's how Unstoppable came. That's what you used to tell Jamie before status. We was the only sound push local talent up to now more than any one of them. Because infamous singer song, Jamie, when Jamie did. Jamie, he, he, he used to play the music so fine, he used to make him feel so good. And them time he ain't, he ain't like they gave us music to play, but we were just pushing he footsie, all of those artists, Mel Jezidic School, all them there. We push everybody, Bamboo B, Ash Kanash. Them time before, them time highlight them never out yet, but he had a lot of artists there before them, them, them artists were hitting now. So, but people forget them artists from long time. Mm -hmm. You check? It's the Rasta man them who create this kind of singing thing here. He had some in the country, I forget the name. House of Judah. He had Mel Jezidic from Newton. A lot of artists, we used to keep local show. We were doing better than, to me, back in them days, we were doing better than these guys now because they, they ain't on a unity. Them man used to create show all in the street. You remember? Yeah, and singing going on, and it was going. And it was a positive vibe. It was a positive vibe going. But these guys now come with, we gonna kill you, too much war, too much separation. Make the music feel like, just like Jamaica. But Jamaica people, them only doing this thing to make a money. You think Cartel and Beanie Man Wine or Beanie and Bunty Killer Wine? It's just to make the people then feel the worrying and then they make some money to hype up but these guys like they're taking it real and it's is a joke thing. Mm -hmm. They need to stop that and let it get together and push ourselves. And if we get serious real quick. Yeah.
Because back in the days, main line, they show them how you used to be the MC for Mel Jezik School. When they come out, the whole place turn up. Mm -hmm. I had me one or two songs and I would bust them, go on mm -hmm. And you know what I mean? And the people them like hear them show and I say, wow. And that's why I encourage me, because I used to sing before and MC before I play song. Mm -hmm. I just get up after that, three D kind of done out. I said, the man said, bye, go play some song. And then I started to play with Executioner and Evolution mm -hmm. back in them days. But Evolution, I was really with Executioner. Eh? Mm -hmm. But true, when we playing Golden Ham and then we also want to give me the door. I'm oh, being yeah. honest now. Mm -hmm. Some people might not hear the truth, but then we also want to give me the door. But you probably also, when you play playing and nobody to chat the mic, and you say, Boski, come chat the mic for me. Eh? And then when I done chat the mic, all everybody in the dance saying, Five guineas here. Boski, what you want? Why you want to drink? Why are you mash up the party? Next day when I go on your tongue, them man telling me, you're going to have Snapchat evolution, Mike, you know? Because everybody saying is how you mash up the party last night, you know? <laughs> And then from there, I just, after a while, I just, say, man, I'm going to go with you, Balen, because me encourage them to bring this setting goal in a man. Mm -hmm. And them are all more positive in what they were doing at the time, and I say, let me go with evolution. And then we read somewhere, you know what I mean? until interruption and then me and Jamie just have to mm -hmm. create and stop with it. You spoke about the positivity in the industry and we all remember those days of being in the school. Sometimes you would have poets as well yeah. and that kind of vibe. Now we have seen um, entertainment in St. Kitts and Nevis get to a level where it's no longer that and some persons are concerned about the level of graphic content within the not only the music but what the DJs are saying while the music is playing. Can you speak about that? To be honest, some people might not like hear certain things, eh? Mm -hmm. But you got some people certain in all the sound them are like. Mm -hmm. Every sound sometimes to me how I see it is just like entertainment still now. Mm -hmm. A person might say certain things. But they ain't really saying it because they want to say it is to go with the song mm -hmm. and it's to get the song forward. They might talk something thing like, you know what I mean, out of the way. Mm -hmm. People, some people might not like it, but some more majority like it because the world today, they can't hide nothing from the youth. Mm -hmm. I went to a prom a time and the teacher telling me, don't play something song in the prom. It was washy prom. And I say, teacher, do you know the kids them have internet? She said, yeah, ah, when are you going to work, they put them on the internet and they type in whatever they want to type in and they're seeing the same thing, they're singing the same thing. And she said, well, Emma, we ain't going to want this round in the place. And then Emma, we come out now mm -hmm. and put her in she place and say, let the DJ play where you want. Mm -hmm. I've been to America. Tom, I mean, they're going out. It's the last time. Let the youth them enjoy themselves. You know, it's just music. Mm -hmm. Because TV promoting all kind of thing, the biggest thing on TV is guns and sex. If you ain't got that in a movie, you ain't gonna sell. So when they're trying to blame the little simple things or some man or whatever, you got a bigger picture out there. And they got to start at the bigger picture before they come down here. Mm -hmm. See what I'm saying? Yeah, I see what you're saying. Okay then. <laughs> okay, so tell us the final word that you'd like to leave with our audience. What is it that you would like our audience to remember about Unstoppable Songs? I just want the audience to remember the good time we, we also have with them. Because we ain't playing this song for money. If I'm playing this song, I'm playing this song for the lovers, eight and for the people. Once you come to somebody's session, they hire you. I think your aim is to sell off the bar and make people come in and enjoy themselves. I don't think the dance should just be bad man, bad man, bad man, as something sound doing it. Because this sound thing ain't just for bad people. This sound thing is for the sexy girls that may take the time and fix up themselves and come dance. Mm -hmm. And then man feel like the dance is just shoot out the star all night and then feel like, yo, we're playing something good. No, we got to change around here and actually I trying to change that long time yeah. mm -hmm. since I'm in evolution now. But something is out the gun and so I bring in the girls a little more and party, make the party balance. When I mean balance, a little hip-hop R&B. If you want to hit a two gospel for the people, then we're going to church tomorrow. 
You know what I mean? You could drop a top. Mix it up a little soaker for the girls, then make them wine. So nobody thinking about just shoot out the style, everybody more. I feeling good boy. Mm -hmm. Real party boys. That's how the party should be. And I want to come back that to that level. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Well, I just want to say, you know, once you come, come out to a dance with Unstoppable, you're going to enjoy yourself. So, nothing more to, nothing more to say about it. Um, it's a crazy song. We get hype, you know. When we get hype, we get mad. Yeah. We jump up. We do all kind of things. Uh, it's all about the music. We feel the music. Yeah. So, basically, okay. once you come out, we put, we best aim. Like, you come and we say, bah, you're too pussy in there, so we, we ain't feeling it. Man, a dog alone could, a dog alone could be in the dance. We're we going to act like that. you. Um, mm -hmm. That's what we be. Come and you check? We can play. Straightforward, yeah. There you had it. I'm Jamie with Zone Plus Media. We have been sitting down with Unstoppable Songs.